multiplying mixed numbers. We've done something similar when before we multiplied a whole number times a regular fraction. We had to turn this whole number into an improper fraction by putting it over a denominator of 1. Can we turn this mixed number into an improper fraction? The answer is yes. To do that, we multiply the whole number times the denominator. So 2 times 2 is 4, plus the numerator, which gives me 5, and the denominator stays the same. So 2 and 1 half is the same as 5 seconds, or 5 over 2. And so I've turned this mixed number into an improper fraction, just like before we turned this whole number into an improper fraction. Then we're going to multiply it by the other fraction using our same steps. Numerator times numerator is 5. Denominator times denominator, in this case, is 4. Now, this answer is an improper fraction, and it needs to be simplified. So 5 over 4. 5 divided by 4 would be 1, with 1 left over. 1 and 1 fourth would be my final answer. So the extra step is to turn this to an improper fraction. These are the directions that we used before. The only difference is, for step number one, write any whole number or mixed number as an improper fraction, and then we continue to follow the same steps. So, looking here, I need to turn this mixed number into an improper fraction. Two times three is six, plus two more is eight. Denominator stays the same. Times, now I have a whole number this time, whole numbers also turn to improper fractions, and we do this by always placing the whole number over a denominator of 1. All right, well, this is going to give me 8 times 9, which is 72, 3 times 1, which is 3. This one's quite large and needs to be simplified as an improper fraction. So over here to the side, I'm going to do 72 divided by 3. 3 could go into 7 twice. That would be 6. Now I have 12. 3 can go into 12 four times. That uses all 12, nothing left. So my answer is actually 24. All right, another example. 4 and 1 half times 1 and 1 third. This time two mixed numbers, but I'm just going to turn each of them into an improper fraction. 4 times 2 is 8, plus 1 is 9 over 2, denominator stays the same, times 1 times 3 is 3, plus 1 more is 4, 4 over 2. All right, next up, multiply the numerators, multiply the denominators. 9 times 4, 36. 2 times 2, 4. And then simplifying if possible, 36 divided by 4, which is 9. So each of these totaled a whole number answer instead of making a mixed number. solve these, please, in your math journal. Simplify if possible.